Hi everyone, meet again with adult recap film. In this video we will discuss a film called Assassination Classroom. This film is adapted from the anime of the same name and has two seasons. Have you ever thought? When you first enter a new semester, and there is a new homeroom teacher but the homeroom teacher is not a person. But rather an octopus-like figure who can talk and likes to smile. And uniquely. You are ordered to kill the homeroom teacher. Well, I'm curious. Watch the story until the end of this film, and don't forget to support this channel with subscribe. The film begins with a sighting of the moon which has been 70% destroyed by aliens. And aliens who will also destroy the earth. Hearing that, finally the military on earth is very afraid. But these aliens offer to postpone the destruction of the earth until next year. With one condition. He became one of the teachers in a junior high school on earth. The offer was then accepted by the military on earth. The story then switches to class 3E, which is a collection of naughty children, who are given a special task by the Japanese army to kill the yellow octopus that has destroyed part of the moon. The reason? If he is not killed in one year then he will destroy the earth. In addition, there is also a prize of 10 million yen or 1.1 billion. Initially dozens of junior high school children were ordered to kill using a special knife and shoot the octopus with a rifle. But, in reality it is not that easy. It turns out that the octopus also has extraordinary speed much faster than a jet plane. Then, came a woman named Siriana Yalavij. He is a highly skilled professional assassin. At first he was sent to kill the yellow octopus. But since then he became their English teacher and taught how to become a professional killer. Shyota Nagisa is the main character of this film. The first conflict took place in a classroom and started when a student asked Nagisa to bring a bomb filled with anti-octopus bullets. But their plan failed. The octopus managed to escape quickly with a red face and angry feelings. He threatened the students who told Nagisa to do this and lectured them not to do anything dangerous. Then he also taught them something to kill, without making a sacrifice. Finally, they started to be happy and liked the octopus. With the consent of the students of grade 3. They agreed to name the octopus with the name Koro-sensei. From the name Koro-sensei, Koro means in Japanese which means not to be killed. And sensei which means teacher. The second problem occurs when a transfer student named Akabane Karma arrives. She is a very smart student who was previously in the main class like Nagisa. Because he had hurt his classmate and bullied him then he was transferred. Because Koro-sensei knows the natural background of Akabane. Even Koro-sensei will change his attitude with the power of Koro-sensei's power and punish him. But the way of punishing him is very unique. He gave food to Akabane because he looked so pale. Then he also put food into the Akabane's mouth to make it healthier. And Koro-sensei also paint Akabane nails with cute pictures. Of course, this is in stark contrast to the Akabane character. Akabane, also tried to fight him off. But quickly Koro-sensei put a very cute apron over him. Akabane then tested for corrosion by jumping from a very high hill. But Koro-sensei cleverly managed to save a kaban. And finally Akabane's attitude changed instantly. Then, there are two more students from class 3. She is a robot named Ritsu who is a woman who communicates through screens and is equipped with full weapons. His goal came to third class because he wanted to kill Koro-sensei and attack Koro-sensei. Therefore other students do not like it. But thanks to the advice of Koro-sensei, Ritsu became close and very friendly with other friends. A few days later, there is another new student named Atona. Ritsu explains that he was trained in assassination along with him. Itona's goal was to kill people who were stronger than her. During school hours, Itona invites Koro-sensei to fight with her in class. But suddenly the Korsain-sai's tentacles broke off. It turns out that Itona also has tentacles in her hair. Koro-sensei remembered something unpleasant, which then made him very angry with his face turning red. He asked, where did he get the tentacles? Finally, Ayatona managed to corner Koro-sensei. However, Koro-sensei, also managed to defeat Atona with an anti-octopus knife. Since Atona is also the same it seems Koro-sensei has a weakness with anti-octopus blades. After a few months, the third-year students were educated by Koro-sensei and the defense general named Kurosama. 
Dipe will also be formed by a teacher named Takoka. At first Takoka looks good as he starts giving food to the students. But its true nature is not like that. Because he looks really hard on educating the students. Looks like he's forcing students who can no longer run. So that one of the students said he prefers being educated by Kurosuma. While about to hit the students, Kurosuma was immediately stopped by Takoka and ordered him to stop the training. He refused and gave a fight challenge. However the dual challenge was not for Kurosuma, but for the students. He explained that he lost against his student. Then he will resign. Kurosuma chose Nagashi to fight Takoka in a fight. Because Nagashi has something of great potential can fight Takoka. Nagashi quickly won the match because Takoka couldn't read Nagashi's movements. And Takaoka left the school. Someday, Koro-sensei will hold an exam and it will be beneficial for every student. Students who get the highest score in the subject will have the right to destroy one of its tentacles. So, when he loses his tentacles, then he will also lose some of his power. He couldn't control his shadow anymore. And if he loses one of his tentacles again then his speed will decrease and weaken. Finally, provided a great opportunity for the person who was going to kill Koro-sensei. In the end, Koro-sensei taught his students one by one to get good grades. Koro-sensei also teaches how to overcome weaknesses in other areas that students don't like. And a few days later, students managed to get good grades. But, the disciples didn't kill him now. They planned to kill Koro-sensei during next summer vacation. Finally, summer vacation has arrived. On summer vacation, the students are ready with full weaponry. They finally manage to cut off Koro-sensei's tentacle. After cutting off its tentacles, they do the action by preparing water. Because after a long time they learn. They also know Koro-sensei's weakness, namely water. After cutting off its tentacles, they do the action by preparing water. Because after a long time they learn. They also know Koro-sensei's weakness, namely water. However, their plan failed. Because the sensation changes its shape, become a crystal that can only be broken for 24 hours. Other than that, the students suddenly fainted from being exposed to a virus caused by Takaoka. Slyly, Takaoka will heal his friends with the antidote he brings. And by exchanging Koro-sensei who has become a crystal, and, suddenly Atona came after Nagashi and Akabane who took Koro-sensei away. While other students, care for those with the virus. Nagashi who was carrying Koro-sensei then went up to the electric tower. There he and Akabane fought Atona, which Nagashi had predicted would rain. Therefore, he purposely climbed to the top of the tower. So it is exposed to rain, because he is afraid of water just like Koro-sensei. But Koro-sensei is safe from the rain because he is in the shape of a crystal ball. Nagashi then hugged Atona and released the tentacle on Atona's head. Nagashi finally returns to school. Seeing his friends who have been held hostage by Takoka. Nagashi cleverly managed to trick Takoka who previously exchanged Koro-sensei for the ball. While Akaban rescues friends who are being held hostage. And finally, they manage to defeat Takoka and his men. Eventually. Koro-sensei was taken somewhere by the government to be destroyed. Moments before being blown up Koro-sensei gave words to his students. There is no greater happiness for a teacher than to see his students grow and develop. He is also grateful and feels happy to be their teacher. And the next time has come. Koro-sensei successfully destroyed. And the students are saddened by the loss of Koro-sensei. But suddenly, they were surprised by the presence of Koro-sensei who was behind them. And the story back with Koro-sensei who taught back in grade 3. And everyone looks happy while shooting Koro-sensei. Before this story ends there is an Atona guard who wears a white robe who has not been identified. And the movie is over. So, don't forget to help support this channel by subscribe, like, and turn on the bell. See you in the next video. And bye.